No. Oops, I accidentally did some lemonade. You thief. <laughs> All right, Jarrett, talk to me. What do we got going on today at the shop? We are close to being able to put in the Bronco motor, the first on our block, the legalized Coyote Bronco, sixth gen Coyote Bronco. Sixth yeah. gen? Sixth gen. You think it'll work? I think we'll get it in there, getting well, everything else. What did, we, ha what did we have to do to, to get ready to sit it inside? Tear it apart. We had to take off the front uh, body connector uh, bar, just a supporting piece for the upper body. And uh, we were able to move some stuff around, get off the 12 spot welds on each side. 24 spot welds, that was a lot. Non-structural crossfit. Non-structural crossfit. For some reason they welded it in. Yeah. They could have easily bolted it. Could have so, been bolted in. We'll probably put in a bolt-in replacement for it once we figure out how to route it. We just gotta go put the motor in. That's the easy part. We're gonna do that today. Yep. We're putting it in today. Technology. <clears throat> John. Does your chain hang low? Does it wobble to the flow? Could you tie it in a knot? Can you tie it in a bow? No. Does your chain hang low? I found it. The hell is that? This isn't right. You gotta keep it left. Up here. This isn't right. This is left. Dude, I'm stuck. <laughs> Holy crap, I'm gonna get smashed. Scoot over. Scoot over. Excuse me, could you could you could you tell us what's happening right now? You're about to die if you say that. Squirt, 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 squirt. What am I doing? Holding the back? Yeah, I'm rotating. And you wanna pull out your deck stand that was on that side? Squirt, squirt. He probably went out and met her. You can't help him, John. Jeez. <laughs> it's the story of your life. Now I know why you're a joke man. You're a little joke bat. My joke bat. Dang, this is about to tip over.
Ty is Jake from State Farm. Ty is Jake State Farm? Yeah. Guys. Dude, I don't think this is going to fit. Yeah, I think so. good hi <laughs> guys so we are about prepped to get this thing into the Bronco for the first time ever but first we need to get this uh, gen 3 composite oil pan off the bottom of the coyote i think what we're gonna do right now once we drop it we'll take the uh, pickup that's over here pull that off it's just an o-ring i'm pretty sure on these uh, and we're just gonna probably maybe put some uh, covering over there so oil doesn't drip everywhere but otherwise we're gonna just run without the oil pan right now so that we can see what kind of clearance we're dealing with and then we don't damage anything so that should be the only thing the girdle and the uh, uh the tray should be under here as well so that'll kind of protect things in case there's any damage uh, but otherwise, let's go ahead and try and get this guy off right now and then get into the car. All right, guys, so we got the oil pan off. I totally forgot on the Gen 3 that uh, it's all integrated into the uh, pan itself. So if you look over here, you can see the actual pickup is right there. There's a dipstick and the uh, well, winded tray, uh, all that stuff is already built into the plastic composite. So obviously that doesn't work when you're trying to swap things. Um, and so we've got it off there right now. 
looks nice and clean when we were under there. Now we've got some plastic and a bungee just to make sure it's held. So if there's any oil that was uh, left in the engine, um, it's not dripping all over the car. And here we've got the uh, power by the hour um, replacement Gen 1, Gen 2 for Gen 3. In essence, it comes with the windage tray. It comes with a Gen 1, Gen 2 oil pan. And the key for being able to make that run is obviously the pickup tube. So um, not saying that this is going to 100% work because of the way the um, front axle and the steering um, cylinder, uh, master cylinder is situated in there that we're probably gonna have to modify that uh, pan or just figure out another pan altogether and make a custom one. But at least we have the parts in here uh, to get everything else that we need. Modify this pickup tube, we've got a windage tray, etc. So at least this is where we're gonna start. But first off, let's get the motor into the car. Money is trivial. Dude, Money is trivial. Trade in a shift cable. Can we get that out of there? Yeah. Dude, there's a lot of stuff in the way that needs to be. No, you owe me money. <laughs> I will not give you an. This needs to be moved somehow. Bleep. We'll bleep it out. Bleep, 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 bleep. Nick, go bleep, bleep, bleep. What are you working on down there, buddy? I don't know. The holes don't line up. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Where's your camel toe thingy? Simple bare necessities. You just lift it up and over? Yeah. Good. Good? And then this should be all the way right? Maybe oh, that? Yeah, it's gonna go off to one side or something. <laughs> yeah. Uh, just bring it off to the other side because that's actually where I will be at. Oh. I got your toes down here. Give me one. I got. I hit. I hit. You don't have the nuts to hold no, those on. Hello. Did you hear my joke? Right hey, did you hear my joke? I can take it out. Look at this. Good. Did you hear my joke? No, I don't care about your I joke. I said you don't have the nuts to hold that down. Okay, Mr. Lead Ball. <laughs> my milkshake brings all the 50 inch flaws. Flaws. Damn right, it's better than y'all. Damn right. I'd have to charge. There's a machete. There's a lot of stuff in Knees, weak arms, spaghetti. Knees, weak arms are heavy. There's vomit on my sweater already because it's your mom's. I can't believe you agreed. <laughs> I can't believe you agreed to making this an automatic V8. It's dark down there and very scary. <laughs> well, you could have a headlamp. That's why I would never get... Jared bought you a very cool headlamp and you denied it. I don't even know where it is. You lost it, dude. You probably stuck it upstairs and wants me to go on another goose, wild goose chase. Hey, what moment is it, Jarrett? It's do or die. It's do or die. Yeah, let's see. Let's see this baby in there. Cross members gotta come out. Okay. Sure, 
Now once you finally get a taste of the race, you'll never look back once you felt that. Don't let somebody take your time and your worth. Just focus on yourself first. guys so we attempted to throw it in there we got pretty darn close we ultimately aborted and decided to take it out we were thinking about cribbing it up uh, but it just didn't make a lot of sense to risk anything like that um, we needed to ultimately move our um, uh, distributor load lifter around um, not the best load lifter really should get a, a different one of those that has a, a, a better way to use a power tool to be able to swap it uh, but really the the issue was is we were just uh, catching these uh, motor mounts um, and so we took this this one out already this one's simple uh, this guy is not so much just because the diff's there so it had two small bolts on the bottom uh, we were able to get them out so no big deal now the other thing I wanted to do was be able to see if it's going to contact when we lift it up with that center uh, cross member that would go right here um, and so we took out the heat shielding and the padding uh, that would be in the tunnel right um, above the transmission um, so with those two things out, I think it'll be a little bit more useful and uh, a little bit easier to get it in this next go around. So here in a little bit, we're going to go ahead and try it again. Yo, I think about others way before myself, yeah. I guess that's why I feel like I go through hell, damn. Wasting time on your dreams instead of mine, yeah. About to turn this franchise around on a dime, man. It's all about finding your right state of mind. It's all about turning the worst into fine. It's all about time and the work and the climb. From the thirst, we will rise. I'm immersed in this life. Don't let somebody take your time and your worth. Just focus on yourself first. Don't let somebody take your time and your worth. Just focus on yourself first. Don't let somebody take your time and your worth. Just focus on yourself first. Don't let somebody take your time. 